Yo, 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 what's up, YouTube? It's a Cartridge Master here again today for another card tutorial. So today, I'm going to show you guys my top five favorite decks that I have. I've never played with any other decks, so I don't know if any of them will be better if I get new cards or whatever. But the ones that I have, I'm going to show you guys my five favorites. So, before we begin, please like this video and subscribe down below and comment on any videos you guys want me to do next. So, without further ado, let go get on with my collection. Yo, welcome. This is my top five, starting with number five. Number five is the Bicycle Archangels deck. First of all, about these cards is, I've had these cards for a while, the box isn't really messed up. I like the box because it has gold trimmings on it. Gold and stuff like that. I just think it looks legit. And the spade also on the box looks legit. Anyways, I like the back design um, of these cards. They're white and black, which makes it look kind of cool. Kind of reminds me of the ghost deck, kind of, a little bit. Um, the next is, it's a bicycle deck, so obviously they do good at fanning. Um, it's an air cushion finish. They're designed by Tom Lane. But they're air cushion, so they fan out well. And all of these cards that I'm going to show you are basically air cushion finished. Or they, if you can see that, if my camera will focus. They, anyways, they have a little bit of pockets in the back of them. For air to come in, that's why they call it air cushion. But they shuffle well, and they fan really well. So, yeah, that is definitely my number five. Alright, so next is number four. Number four is the Bicycle Prestige. First of all, the box it comes in as top-notch. Like, I like the box. It's protective. And the back design is really casual. It looks really prestigious, you know. Prestigious. These are 100% plastic cards. So they are plastic and they don't mess up at all. Because if you bend them, you can bend them. And they just go back to the normal position. You see, you can bend it and it flies out of view, but... It goes back to its normal position. Um, they don't really fan that well. I mean, they kind of, they kind of feel like paper-like. You know, they're the only plastic cards to give away a paper-like feel. And so it's cool that Bicycle actually made a prestige deck of cards. And there's this also cool ad card that I'll read to you guys. It says many professionals prefer the flexibility and durability of plastic cards. Bicycle Prestige offers unmatched durability and is the only 100% plastic card to offer a paper-like feel. Perfect for a neighborhood game or professional tournament. So these cards are 100% plastic and they give off a paper-like feel. And you can totally feel it. I recommend these cards, um, but I, I don't use them often because they are plastic and they kind of slip out of my hands often, as you've seen in other videos. But it's just generic stuff. A normal Ace of Spades, normal cards. So, that is my number four bicycle prestiges. Number three is the bicycle auto cycle decks. I have it in green and purple. I'll show you the purple one because the purple one is my favorite. But they come in two different blue, greens, and purples. So the purple, the back's design, first of all, is awesome because they have two bicycles, two guys riding bicycles, and it's just, you know, a standard back design. And they're bicycle cards, and they're kind of newer for me, so I'm not, I don't do so good with newer cards. I do way better with older cards, but they fan well, they cut pretty well, they do really good ripple shuffles. And so, yeah, they're really new, like I haven't broken in on these purple ones yet. Um, but they're standard, they have some, they even have the ad cards still in there. I, I've never taken them out. See, the jokers are normal. Everything's normal about these cards. There's nothing too special. So, there is the purple ones. If I can put them back in the box. 
and I'll also show you the green ones just so you can see the back design on the green ones here they're basically the same thing except the back design is the same but it's just green so those are my number fours the bicycle auto cycle decks in green and purple number two two is bicycle flying machines playing cards first of all the box all right, it's not like any other bicycle box that you've seen it's cool it's unique and it has woods on the back it doesn't show the back design it has woods on the back and I think it's very cool I also have it in blue um, I'll show you the blue deck just cuz I like the blue deck better but yeah the box first of all is the coolest secondly is the back design the back design is pretty cool. It shows a guy riding a bicycle and a hot air balloon. I don't know. It's pretty unique though. Like I haven't broken in on these cards either, so they're a little bit newer cards. But they are like just like all bicycles, they shuffle well and they fan really well. And so these were actually designed by. Wait, who were they designed by? There's a card in here. That shows what's cool. They were designed by um, Mark Stutzman. He is a very famous card designer. Um, so I appreciate these cards. The next is look at the pips. The pips have gears in them. Same with the hearts, spades, and clubs. Even. Everything has gears on them. Um, the next thing about these cards is the jokers. These are what the jokers look like. They one guy's crashing and then the other joker I think is perfectly fine. It's weird because one joker's crashing and the other is perfectly fine. So I think it's cool. And last but not least, the aces. Every ace in this deck has its own individual special blimp or flying machine design. So the ace of hearts has this design with the hearts on it. The Ace of Clubs has a balloon or a blimp with clubs on it. The Spades has a hot air balloon ship thing with spades on it. And the Diamonds have kind of a blimp sort of house thing with diamonds on it. So I think it the Aces individually. And I just think this deck is cool in general. You know, I like the color that they used for blue. These cards, you know, they're awesome. So, now what I will do is I'm going to show you the reds just so you can see the back design. So, the reds and the cards are the exact same. But instead, they're red. So, these cards are my number two. And now, my number one most favorite cards that I have are Bicycle Autumn playing cards all right they have an air cushion finished as you can see there that's spanish there we go air cushion finished made in usa my my phone camera's a little bit suckish so anyways what i like about these cards is first of all the back design the border is perfect and the back design is very fall like and i like it because the colors are cool they shine when they're in light as you can see in these like corner areas right here and it's just symmetrical, and I just like the cards because I can flip it one way, and it's the same exact thing. I love cards like that. All bicycle cards are made like that. Um, just like normal bicycle cards, they are air cushion finished, just like all my other decks, except for the bicycle prestiges. These aren't air cushion, but the the autumn deck is. So they fan out really well, and they do fans. I haven't broken in on them again because. They are kind of newer. Um, I did them. I used them for my last video, which if you guys want to watch it, I can put it in the description box below. So thank you. And I got these for Christmas. Another cool thing is the colors are a little bit darker, so the blacks look a little more purple and the reds look a little more like dark red. You know, it's kind of cool. And the Ace of Spades is another thing I wanted to show you guys. So the normal aces are just normal, but the ace of spades is 
actually unique. It shows the back design on the Ace of Spades. So I think that's pretty cool. And the Jokers, I think all the Jokers are just the same. Yeah, Jokers are just the same, except they show a little bit of leaves. I think that's kind of unique, you know. Just made specifically for the Autumn deck. So, yeah, thanks for tuning in, guys, on my five favorite decks that I own. And if you guys want to follow me on social media, they will show up right here. Yo, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, so these are my five favorite cards, you know. I'm actually holding the Autumn deck right now just because I, I love it so much. It's so amazing. Um, to tune in on my last video, they will be in the description box down below. And to follow me on social media, they should show up somewhere on the screen. It, it takes a little bit of time, so make sure you check your watches. Um, at approximately whenever this video, I, I don't know, just sometime in this video, they should show up. So, follow me there. And I'd just like to give a shout out to all of my subscribers and everyone who watches my videos. You guys are amazing. 27 subscribers. I've only gained two in the past, in the past few months, but that's alright. I'm hoping to get better and, you know, be able to do this stuff a lot more with you guys. So, please make sure to comment down below and pick out any video you guys want me to do next. Um, and please also, I'm gonna, I'm thinking of starting a reaction channel, um, here coming up soon, because I like reactions, and so, um, that new video will be called Z Reacts. I will put the link to my first video in the description box below when it comes out. I'm thinking of doing a video tomorrow. Um, I have a new schedule that I will also post in the description box down below, and I'll probably explain it in a later video so be sure to stay tuned for my next video and i'll see you guys in the next video remember keep mastering life